Alright, ladies and gentlemen, so everybody else is making a video on it. I didn't think I was going to because I was like, I have no idea what this is. But, um, I've watched, uh, Beats PH and he said that he's thinking that we're going to be getting a free fest unit and it, it kind of makes sense. Uh, because when you look at this, it says 354 summons. So maybe there's a guaranteed at 300 and then a guaranteed at a 600 because I believe 150, how many summons is that? 154, uh, divided by 11. Uh, isn't that just like 14 multis? Is that what that is? Uh, 154 divided by 11. Yep, 14 multis. And then possibly we, uh, after every 7 multis, we get a free fest unit. Because as you can see, that's Goddess Liz is uh, cut in at the very beginning on the left. And then Esknor flipped upside down, possibly. Or maybe we're only getting one of them and they're like the only ones on the banner. I'm not too sure. Um, but. I assume we'll be getting uh, the free ba uh, banner sometime this week, probably on Thursday, uh, for JP as we start getting into our uh, anniversary for uh, JP. Also, just for the global players, probably going to be in about three to four weeks for glo uh, Global's anniversary, like or like us getting the JP anniversary uh, in about two weeks for JP. Um, but yeah, this is the only thing I can really think of. We're going to be getting 14 free multis, and the one Escanor and Goddess Liz could possibly be on it. Um, the, like I, I honestly thought that they were teasing the new Fest unit, but then when you actually zoom in on this picture, this is definitely just a Goddess Liz PNG. Um, so yeah, it looks like we're hopefully going to be getting a free uh, dupe, like Fest coins. Like If we get free Fest coins, then I guess I get uh, enough... Uh, coins to actually be able to trade someone up which is pretty cool because i already have one fast coin but uh we also haven't gotten the selector yet for some reason like where we actually like vote and uh choose what's on the banner so hopefully we're actually able to do that um hopefully this is the fever banner or maybe it's just a whole free banner on its own like it's a free banner uh and then we get a fever banner as well that it's like 10 multis usually um the fever banner is where all the uh like the christmas lilia would be the uh uh, Green Demon Melly, you know, all those limited time characters that are meant for only holidays, you know, Blue Derriere, stuff like that. Because they will not be on the banner. Now, Ragnarok units might be on the banner, on the uh, anniversary banner, um, because they're technically not limited because they have been throwing them on on basically every single banner. Um, so hopefully we're able to vote for like the Miguel, the, the Jormungandr, uh, we can vote for the Tarmiel and Sario. Um, so that way we can make one of the best banners of all time because that's what the anniversary banner should be in my opinion it should be the best banner of all time uh but yeah i uh i'm excited to see what they do with this banner because uh, i mean if they get free fest coins there you go you guys can hopefully uh, get something six six or maybe just get a free unit like trade it up um hopefully we were actually able to trade up for trader melly because technically once the anniversary drops he should be in the coin shop he should be unless they really scuff it because it's a dark coin and not a regular fast coin but uh you can trade up trader melly coins for regular festivals so i'm gonna assume you can trade them out but uh yeah a small little recap also for global players there's gonna be e free this week i didn't care about doing a video because it didn't really matter but uh yeah hope you guys enjoyed make sure you hit that like button subscribe and hope you guys have an absolutely amazing day and uh yeah if you guys see anything else on here that i somehow missed even though that's probably the case uh let me know peace